All right, guys. So this is where we're at right now. I'm happy with the location of the live rock for the most part. We'll work out some final movement as I go further. So I've taken out some of the water so I can do the cycle start. So after thinking about it for a little while, seeing as I'm kind of experimenting with BioSpire, I have used it in my 125 gallon. So... I do have a little bit of experience with it. Nothing bad. This is the 3.38 um, full ounce bottle. It says it treats up to 30 gallons. So um, I've been reading up on this and apparently it's best just to use everything uh, since bacteria is bacteria is bacteria. So, um, you know, just if you're wondering, let me see if I can get this thing focused. This is what it purports to do. And these are the ingredients on the back. So... Let me get the camera down there. So principal ingredients are purified salt water, patent and patent pendant strains of nitrospira, nitrosimonus, nitrospira, and nitrococcus. So those are different strains of bacteria that is used to make up biospira these are some of the instructions and from what I've been told or what I've read uh, we're probably gonna want to add fish immediately afterward because um, there is some bacteria required from the fish and the fish food to, to activate this to, to allow the tank to cycle so uh, what I plan to do here is I'm going to go ahead and uh, lift the filter out and pour it underneath the filter of the Fluval Spec 3. By the way, uh, just some pro tip for you guys that haven't bought the tank yet. Uh, my entertainment center the shelves attach from the back so there there tends to be some sagging underneath uh, because of the added weight of the aquarium so uh, what I did was I kept the foam from the packaging so that I could use it underneath the tank and uh, use it here to kinda give us a good water level as best as possible before um, I don't know if you were able to notice or not but in my previous videos uh, the water wasn't as level and um, I will play this play around with this a little bit more but uh, just a pro tip here to leave um, that foam um, handy so if you need to use it later for something like that uh, just a, a pro tip so what we're going to do here is lift the foam out and as you can see I did insert, insert the cartridges 